Arena in Donetsk. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It is Manchester City facing Real Madrid. Well, the first game of the group is so vital, you just can't get off to a losing start. This could be a tight battle today, Derek. And so the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Nathan Ake plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Jack Grealish plays with Phil Foden out wide. And handed the task of playing up front is Erling Haaland. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. David Alaba plays with Antonio Rudiger in central defence. Federico Valverde plays with Vinicius Jr. in the wide areas. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway De Bruyne Silva it's with Laporte Bernardo Silva and De Bruyne in a useful looking position but will there be an end product a well, fine reading of the situation Based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. Well, a yellow card so early in this one, Stuart. Well, it doesn't matter how early it is in the game. That's a poor challenge and deserved the booking. Attack going up a dead end, and the keeper has the ball. Holland now with Silva, Foden, Grealish must be no way through. Now oh, that's a well timed pass. And now waiting to pounce. Oh, couldn't beat the goalkeeper. And really should have been able to. Oh, that's a fine pass. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. Modric and now Rodrigo and he takes on the shot and throwing himself at the ball <laughs> delivering it
Walker not given a moment to think about it. Foden. Walker now. And a good looking ball. Can he put them in front? And denied by the post. Clears it away. Counter attacking, very much an option. And that's an important intervention. Well, I have to say, City are so unlucky not to be leading now. They look a real Well, they might score the here, Stewart. Well, the opening goal of the night comes from Kevin De Bruyne. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder, and it's a great finish. He holds off the defender, keeps his composure, and finds the back of the net. It's a marvellous goal. Well, the action underway. Can Real find a response now? <laughs> Federico Valverde. Tony Kors. And that pass could be troublesome. Brilliant save. Rodri. Walker now. Holland. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. And there it is, the half-time whistle. And so much to like about the first half performance put in by Kevin De Bruyne. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. It's looking promising. Oh, wonderful save! Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. But he's gone short with it. Just look at this again. He moves the ball quickly, he gets beyond his marker and he keeps his composure. It's an excellent finish. And back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Modric. Bellingham. A wonderful intervention. Well, as the stats confirm, City have controlled the ball, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Now can they win back possession and carve out another chance for themselves? He's in control of the situation. Looking pass, Tony Cross might mean business. And there is the goal! Well, that changes the equation, and they have the momentum now. Well, here it is again, and you have to say the one-two completely opens up the defensive structure. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Go for 
and the ball is moving again anyone's guess how this is going to finish 2-1 currently Silva he's lost it he has teammates around him De Bruyne takes some progress with the ball at his feet Rodri couldn't hang on to the ball in with a chance was it the denial of a clear goal scoring opportunity if so he's off And it is an early shower for him. Red card. Well, the outcome was never in doubt. That was always going to be a sending off. A short free kick this time. A Houdiger. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. Rodri. Phil Foden now. Walker. Pass after pass, happy to just keep possession and frustrate their opponents. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Vinicius Junior could be a chance to break here and the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time Foden might be a chance here and able to close down the shot so full time it is and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign yeah it's so vital to get off to a quick start in these group stages They'll be happy with the three points, but now they have to back it up in the next game. Six points and you're halfway there. Kevin De Bruyne, incisive and influential. How would you sum up what you saw from the Belgian? Well, he scored a good goal, he hit the woodwork and was a constant threat. So overall, he should be really pleased with his display today.